<clears throat> All right, here we go, round number one. The mutts. This looks great. Turn one thought sees. We got force of will, we got a couple of baleful strixes. Means we should be fine against most decks. I'm gonna close some stuff here. Kinda lagging. Don't thought sees me. All right, I will let that resolve. My hand's good enough, I don't need to force that. I don't know what they're on though. If they're on the, um, I guess they're on combo if they're doing that. Lagging pretty bad. See if I can close some more stuff. Pretty much everything's closed. After this round, I will restart my computer. All right, they're not doing anything. I wish I was less laggy. It's good if they're a uh, creature deck. Also, Baleful Strix is better against creature decks than combo decks, obviously. So we're hoping they're on a creature deck. Picking the thought sees though. I'm gonna guess they're on a combo deck. Which kind of leaves us with a force of will and a brainstorm. This lag is really bad. Um, I'm guessing they're on, they're on storm digging. They could be either digging for a discard spell because they have the combo, or they could be digging for anything. I think I need to count. I need to counter this, and then try and find something like a him with my uh, with my brainstorm. Dress. All right, so it's probably probably a uh, storm. So we need to draw a him, a him, basically. Him or I guess thief. Thief can really run away with the game against storm. Our hand's really bad right now though. Him, thief, brainstorm. It's kind of thing we're looking for. Uh, Liliana would be okay. Yeah, it's definitely storm. Alright, that's uh this lag is so bad. I 
At least they only have two cards in hand. So that force seemed like it was a pretty good call. We have lots of uh, potential top decks here. That's kind of one of them. Yeah, that's fine. It's going to be good if we live through our turn. I mean, through their turn. Flag's a bit out of control. Apologize for this. Hopefully it clears up a little bit. I've closed everything on my computer. So we can just get duels here, and then uh, brainstorm. Because if they did, if they hadn't played this, I guess I would plus. Because we're not dead yet, I could plus make them use their fetch. I'm the only thing we're looking for with a brainstorm is uh, forceful. At least for this turn. I think it's worth it. All right, well, if we untap, we're in great shape. That could be the end of the game. With three lands in play and an LED, that's often all they need. Well, a little more likely now that we win. I've accidentally closed out my information bar to see if they're shuffling or whatever. Now I think we probably untap, unless they dark ritual here. Okay, I'll take it. I wish I could see if they topped. I imagine they shuffled if they're passing. All right, so we get to him the last two cards out of their hand and likely win from there. Unless there's a... No, Past in Flames makes it. <laughs> I was going to say, unless there's a Past in Flames, then uh, that certainly changes things. So we know we have a Fatal Push on top. I'm going to... Brainstorm, looking for a Thief of Sanity, or a Force of Will. That's fine. If we knew what they had on top, then we could uh, do that. Could have uh, fate sealed them, but since we don't, because I closed the thing. Three, four, five, six, five. They don't have any. They have a dark ritual, but it doesn't get them the win. So I will brainstorm. Oh 
on the bottom. Now, so now we just have to force the past in flames. Their only card is it land. Don't imagine they go for it because we're going to put that on top if we were losing to it. They might. Doesn't look like they have the win. They don't have any tutors here, so they would have to pass in flames plus mana plus cantrips. Looks like they're going for it. They're probably going to concede to this counter spell then. Be that or not. It's just me. Yep, I'll leave that on top. That is just mana. If I have to bottom something, then I'll cast the Snapcaster Mage. I can also hymn them. Uh, so they have mana and a top deck, and I have Snap Counter. So I will brainstorm here to get rid of these hymns. Order, shuffle. Eh, should not have done that. That's fine. I'll just leave up. Hard cast force will. Looks like they might have drawn something. There's no way we lose this game though, unless I mess up. That will probably get the second pass in flame, so I'll counter that. So play Thief of Sanity. Just in time for the game to already be over. And I've got Snapcaster uh, Counterspell up. So they're still probably trying to get past in flames here. And they're pretty much dead now.
We know we don't want that card. Start out by attacking. See if we can kill them with uh, ad nausea or tendrils. Yes, we can. How about that? <laughs> that is so sweet. Here, hold on. Let's make it more fun. For the funds. For the funsies. If you actually exile it, you don't ever have to cast it because they can't win without it. But since they're dead, this is pretty fun. Got it. All right, so bring in the counter spells. Bring in the thought seizes. Bring in the Oops, don't want those all the way over there because I'm not 100% on those. Bring in these and these. Uh, actually, this is probably better than one of these. We can do one and one, or maybe two and one. Let's see what we want to take out. We can take out Fatal Pushes, one Wasteland. Take these out. These are good. Good, this is bad. Great. All good, all good, all good. All good, all good, all good. Okay, so we have to take out two more spells. Um so kind of like all of these. We have to take out two more. Definitely not taking out Thief. Thief is amazing in this matchup. Um, do a one and one. Well, actually, it's quite good when we have so much discard. These are good for the zeros and for empty. Just take out two Strixes. Those are probably the worst cards. They're just like cantrips for the most part. Yeah, they're just cantrips. That's easy. This is good. It's a good hand. If we make it to the third turn, we have a really good chance of winning. I mean, if we make it to the third, third turn with what we have here, I mean, if they thought sees us, they probably take thought sees, and then we have to make it, yeah, again, pretty far. Okay, so they probably take Thoughtseize because that's our main interaction here. We can go Ponder plus Engineered Explosives though on zero, and that's not bad. Ponder can find a him to Turok. Counterspell on turn two is pretty good. Engineered Explosives, I mean, it stops. Oh, interesting. So they're going to play out their zeros here. Are, are they trying to go for the him then? So that was interesting. Not what I expected. They might fluster this. I'm OK with that, though. Yep. Makes sense. So they have three cards and one land. We have Counterspell next turn. Might not even hold up Counterspell next turn, might just ponder. Depends on what we draw. Probably just hold it up, ponder the following turn, looking for a land, or if we haven't drawn a land. Him? That's definitely not what we're looking for. All right, I will leave up Counterspell. They know we have it, but the Ponder's not looking for much other than uh, Thoughtseize at that point. 
Thought Seize or EE. This turn we get to ponder, especially if we already hit a land. Um, actually. So, we could Wasteland then, or we could ponder. I think we just pass. Could also Thought Seize. That seems pretty good. Empty and ad nauseum. All right, I'll just take the ad nauseum. It's easy, easy take. We have another answer to uh, empty, and they can't really do it for much here. All right, well, if they hit a ritual, they can make some 1-1s, one which might beat us. OK, this is back. Thank you. Two on top. Two on top pass. All right. If we draw a land, we're definitely pondering looking for a him. Or just drawing a him would be pretty nice. Hmm. Seems like they're reconsidering. Two on top, so one on top. They're gonna ponder again. Oh, they're gonna make they're gonna make one ones now. Yeah, this is pretty good. Uh, probably not good enough though. I think I can if I draw a land, I could just bounce, bounce one. Then they have five, then they have four. I guess I better ponder. Hmm. The lands are nice. Liliana is kind of whatever. Um, let's see, I can go land. This seems fine. Play my land and ponder. Trade for two. Seems pretty good. Play my man play my land, ponder. They go down to four of these. I can bounce one that leaves them with three. Probably doesn't win. Uh hmm. Well, that seems pretty good too. Next turn, am I playing Jace or am I playing Thief? Thief lets me, whoops, I should have blocked. That's fine. Play a Thief, block three of them, leaves them with three. We go down to six. Then we attack, play Jace. I think we end up winning this game from here. Not blocking last turn was a click through on accident, but should be okay. Shouldn't have six here. I'll actually just bounce this and pass because of the counter spell. Can't kill Jace this way. I will. We'll see what happens. Um. Yeah. Sure.
can attack before I do anything. I draw like a discard spell or I don't know, an empty. Uh, Fluster Storm seems pretty good. Let's go ahead and draw three. One. That on top. Just gonna make them sacrifice a creature. Uh actually. What should I take? Since I can't decide what to take, I'll do this. Make them sacrifice a creature. And then I have Surgical plus Flusterstorm plus Nile Spellbomb. Jace, Liliana, seems pretty good. Seems. <laughs> seems pretty good. Uh, sure. I think the Flusterstorm in Exile is like unbeatable, I think. Also, Ad Nauseam is gone, so they have to use the graveyard, and I've got two graveyard spells. Seems pretty bad for them. Sure. Uh, if they... What could they do? I don't think they can really do anything that doesn't include their graveyard. That includes their graveyard, but I will fluster storm that one. And pay. Could have made it so they couldn't pay, but they can pay. Uh, yeah, so they they can pay, and then they put the card in their hand, and then I make them discard it, <laughs> and then I exile their graveyard. So yeah, they didn't really have any way to win there. All right, I'm gonna restart everything so it's a little bit smoother. And yeah, see you in a bit for round two.